Krista? Everything okay? Oh, me! Clem, stay back. Don't get any closer. I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him. Hey. Back already? We got you medicine. Good. I feel like I could use some. You okay, kid? You look worse than I do. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Should have left him behind. We had the chance. Guys, what the hell happened out there? Let someone else tell you. I got work to do. Okay, with a little luck, you should start feeling better. I'm not gonna just drop him. I'm past my murdering phase. Let me know if you need anything. I'm in control now. Yes, thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. About what happened to Brady. Don't beat yourself up over it. There was nothing you could have done. You want to know the worst part? What? I don't feel much. I mean, I don't feel enough. Shouldn't I be broken up over what happened to her? That's how I was when I lost my daughter. When I lost my friends in those first few weeks. But now, it's like I just take something like this in stride. Like this is what our world is now. Better just get used to it. What did you want to talk to me about? I know you care about Clementine. Anyone can see that. And I know you want what's best for her. But this plan of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination, do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you, I promise you. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? You're coming at me with a lot here. Of course, take your time, but I want you to think about some things. You're a good man, Lee. You've been protecting these people as best you can so far, and they look up to you, rightly mm -hmm. so. But it's different with a child. You might have brought her this far, but sooner or later she might ask you for more than you can give her. I'm sorry if that's hard to hear, but it's the truth. I appreciate it, Vernon. Let me think about it, okay? You do that. Hey, going somewhere? Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. What are you talking about? Kenny's working on the boat right now. Thought you were coming with us. God knows you earned it. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. It sounds like it'd be pretty crowded, and I never did like the water. You sure about this? I'm sure. I've always done better on my own anyhow listen I'm not much for goodbyes tell the others for me sure you take care of yourself mommy you too Lee that's some sexual tension you be sure to take care of that little girl you know she thinks the world of you good luck Ain't nothing to do with luck. 
That's some mighty fine sexual tension. Hey, sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? We'll go wherever Kenny says. He's a good captain, and he knows the waters down south. He'll know where to take us. Damn, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? That's weird. He doesn't seem the same since he got back. He's just oh. right now. Truth is, he brought this on himself. What do you mean? Look, Ben's a good kid. He means well. Keeps trying to help. But every time he does, he winds up putting the rest of us in even more. I didn't mean to pick that. What happened to <clears throat> Captain Duck? Feels like he was responsible for that. And the fact is, he's right. He was. But you still saved him. Yeah, I still saved him. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? Hell yeah. Sure. We'll look before we leave. Really? You'll take me to Crawford so we can look? We're just in Crawford. I knew you didn't really mean it. Crawford's dead. Don't. Okay. Could have been Clementine? Clementine? Clementine! God. Oh. Oh, Omid's feeling better. Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. Lee? Where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's a walker's. Fucker jumped me from behind. So where's Clementine? Clementine's gone. I found her having a radio on the ground out here. That's all I found. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? And who the hell took her? I don't know. Last night, Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Well, 
wherever she is, I have to find her. Clem may not have much time. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? Lee, I'm sorry. We can't. It's too risky for us. And I have to put him first. He's not well enough to go off on some rescue mission. Krista, I'm fine. I can... Ah. He's just not up to it, Lee. And I'm not leaving him again. I really am sorry. I hope you find her. But you're gonna have to do it without us. This wasn't an easy decision, Lee. I want you to know that. You made it pretty on the spot, so... Lee, man... You know I care about Clementine. And I am a Christian man. But I keep asking myself... If this was me, asking you for help, asking you to put your life on the line, would you be there for me? Has there been plenty of times when you ain't been? What are you fucking talking about? Kitty man, I'm begging you here. I can't do this alone. I need your help, please. You might not have been keeping score, Lee, but I have. And you've been looking out for yourself more often than your friends. I don't remember that. Well, maybe that's a good thing, because you're on your own on this one. What about you, Ben? I don't know. Whatever you think is best. Clementine's one of the few good things left in this world. She stood up for you and Crawford when Kenny wanted you gone. Don't you think you owe it to her to stand up for her now? You're right. I owe her. I swear, before this is all over, I'm gonna show you I can do something right. I'll prove it to you. You'll see. Killing Ben is not... I guess it's just you and me. We should go find Vernon, see if he took her. Good luck. <laughs> yeah, to both of you. Bring Clementine back safe. We'll get the boat out onto the river. Figure we can wait there until you get back. Or at least until nightfall. Come on, kid. Let's go. Damn, we got bit. Ben's the only one who's coming. They're gone. Where the hell are they? This is where you found them before? Uh-huh. Vernon! Get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here! All I want is the girl! Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt! Are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! Vernon, put Clementine back on! I want to talk to her! This is Vernon, and you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine, but if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully.
Did you kill the boy in the attic? Yes, most people did. Did you lie to or, to or threaten Vernon? I was rational and honest. <clears throat> did you bring Clementine? Yes. Did you let Ben fall to his death? Oh, I'm in the ma majority. Did you rev... Oh, a lot of people showed the bite. Damn. So, most people had everybody. That's probably what would happen if you revealed the bite. I don't know how you get Krista and Omid to come with you. And... I mean, if... Huh. Oh, well, most people just had Kenny. At least people just had went by themselves um okay and then like interesting okay cool so I'm like I'm the second minority interesting there's there's no cuts there's no there was there's no trailer for the last one Huh. Okay. Alright, well, I'm gonna finish watching the, the credits. And you guys can move on with your day. So, have a wonderful rest of your day. Stay safe out there. It's, it's getting kind of cold out, if you haven't noticed. It's just past mid-February. And, um, it's not getting any warmer. I don't know where you are, but it's still pretty cold out. Um, yeah, have a wonderful rest of your day. I'll be back with the fifth episode real soon. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. I kind of want to wait and see at the end of the cut the, the if it showcases anything after the credits, but... I don't know. I'm getting real tired. It's, uh, 419. Almost 420. I'll let you know when it's 420, because that's when everything gets wild. And this was a two and a half hour recording. Damn. Let's go to is anything. It's still 2012. It's 420, boys. That's just a vape. Thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.